Today's tale started with Ray awaking early, realizing he needed to cook some goddamn meals. No time to meditate, Ray. No time. The rest slept in, except for Lilith and Veliquist. Holy shit, Veliquist didn't even see you. Didn't even see you, lass. Get to uh, hauling. Hauling it is then. Ray, you definitely need to cook me some meals. Look, there is only four. And there is more than four of us. There is more than four of us. In fact, we are down to three meals. Ray, please to God, cook faster. I don't want people eating just any old crap off the ground. Our potatoes are coming along. Slowly but surely. Slowly but surely. In fact, we could probably install a skylight. Where the hell is our skylights? Over here. Get some skylights up, people. Get some skylights. Getting the roof in. We're nearly inside. Oh, help with the heat issues. Help with the heat issues. Good stuff, people. Good stuff. And then soon, we'll be able to reinstall these into the other areas. She got their rhubarb. Blended leather, eh? Blended leather. Interesting. Interesting. What you got here? A hat? Well, not much you can do with a hat. You got one blended leather. That stuff looks insane. Insane rhubarb. Were you a bit surprised by it? Victor. He just slept in. Victor, why are you still sleeping? What is wrong with you, my friend? What is wrong with you? Ray! Finally, some meals. Meals for these people. Uh. Why are you picking up food and moving it? Bellaquiz? You're a bit of a weirdo, my friend. A wee bit of a weirdo. Engie, off to relax. Have a bit of a socialize. Ranak bringing in the last of the, uh, last of the wood. Excellent stuff, Ranak. Excellent stuff. Meanwhile, the frozen waste. 19 degrees outside. Look at this, boys. Nice and warm inside. Nice and warm. Hmm. Pretty tempted. Still, which bits are unroofed? Interesting. Is it just because of this wall? Well, I tell you what, Angie, can you finish off this wall for me? You know, finish it, woman. Don't just start a job and leave it half finished. Hop, hop, hop. None of that. What? Do you really need to eat? You don't need to eat yet. Don't worry about it, NG. Minor break. Who's having a minor break? Victor? What's wrong with you, buddy? Oh, well, you got rebuffed by Lilith? Well, she's a bitch. Don't worry about her. Don't worry about it, NG. My God, woman. Finish these walls. And then... Build me some... Can't build me any venting? Hmm. Well, if that's going to be how it is, I feel like we'll just move some of these in. Speaking of which, how far does our power extend? Alright, we can probably just jam the heaters on here. And some sunlights. Feel that is the way to go. Mini sunlight. Is it sunlight versus a mini sunlight? Ah. Uh, should have probably used these ones. Oh. Well. 
Oh well, an outdoor light. Hmm. Interesting. Rhubarb off to break down some more things for me. I feel like we could probably reinstall these too. If we could reinstall two of these and still keep our heat. All right, we got some slavers. Well, you guys better have some decent stuff, you know. Because I've been building not much, actually. Not much at all. Ah, Ray, finally catching up on the cooking, eh? Catching up on the cooking. How are you, Muffalo, going? All right, still 20 degrees. Let's see if it starts to break down a bit. 12 in here. 12 in here. Right. Let's heat this place up. Heat it on up. 11 degrees. 19. Hmm. It is struggling a little in here. Need to start getting these double walls down. Hopefully that'll keep our heat in a little. Boys, you need to stop wrecking the heat. Because you are wrecking my heating. 8 degrees and 19. Alright. It'll do, it'll do. Meanwhile, the slavers slowly moved across the frozen waste that was outside. Ooh. Sounds like someone is angry. My god, Timberwolf. Oh, get a bit bruised. But you literally ripped its right leg off. Wow. Rough. Rough, 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 eh? Getting a bit better in there. It's down to four degrees. Alright. Victor, do me a favor, mate. Mate! Get on this. Get on it. Start heating that room. Engie, what are you up to? Engie, start lighting this room. You know? So that we can have some uh, rice, some neutro, and some devil strand. Alright, 19 degrees. Seems pretty constant. Pretty constant. Slowly heat up this room. Lilith, I've got a job for you. Got a job for you. Wait for Mr. Darklight here to get a bit closer. And then you can uh, have a chat to him. Have a chat to him. Bam! Whew, that's some lighting indeed. That is some mighty fine lighting, people. Mighty fine. How much power does this thing use? Whoa! That is a lot of power. In fact, how are we doing on the uh, storage here? Hmm. Things could get a little interesting soon. Since uh, one of these is basically going to be consumed by this room here. I feel like we might have... Uh, hmm. Skylights. It will cancel that. Whoa, we don't want the world. Not the world. Oh dear. Whew. Thought we were broken for a second. Thank you with us. Some skylights. Thanks, Victor. Can you get on these skylights for me? My friend, Victor, Victorino, Al Pacino, build me my skylights. How are we doing, power? Ooh, 14, eh? Uh, can we crank that up just a little? And see how that does. Alright, see how that does. Got ourselves some skylights, but it is dark outside, so fortunately they're not going to do much. 
yet. Oh, Victor. Victor, Victor, Victor. Tempted to woo. And you got rejected. Lilith, quick. Mr. Darklight's inside. So you need to haul some ass and go have a chat to him. See what he wants. What are we doing here? 13 degrees. Interesting. Alright. Well, I'll tell you what, buddy. You only got one. Hmm. Only got one. Well, for that, I will sell you some smoke. Leaf. Joints? Got anything else? Might be interested in? Not really. Not really, people. Hmm. You guys suck a bit of ass, really. Suck a bit of ass. Lilith. Ah, oh, you can't even haul, can you? No siree, you cannot. Unfortunately. A slight pain. Now, Victor, did you finish building these? Finish building these for me, sir. And, uh, hmm. Right, right, good stuff, good stuff. Get that lighting up. Get that walled off. Keep that heat on in. Alright. It's 14 degrees in there. It's actually colder in here, but you know. It's a slightly larger room. Not much we can do about that. Hey, lads. Rhubarb. Still flimmin' reclaiming stuff, eh? How much more stuff you got? Uh, yeah. Looks like a little... Oh, no. You got stuff out here, don't you? You do. A wag fur parker, eh? Actually, you got a lot of stuff to disassemble, my friend. A lot of stuff to disassemble. Right, Angie. What you have to do? Ah, good stuff. Mad animal. A squirrel. Bellaquez. Uh... Do I have a job for you? Quick, Velaquez. Uh, Velaquez? Oh. Come on, Velaquez. Look. Whew. Shot in the neck. Oh, Velaquez. Uh, Velaquez, do me a favor. And, of course, I've just milled it. Good stuff, Velaquez. Fact. Can't do that. Ah, Velaquez. Haul it. Good stuff. Good stuff. The Carrot House Gang survives another mad animal attack. When mad squirrels attack. Part 6. The Squirrelinator. Ah, how's our food going here? Rice is growing away. Mm. It ain't got much light, does it? Does it, people? Well, with that, the Crack House Gang survived another day. Another day, indeed. Velaquez, she defended herself well against the vicious, vicious squirrel. Tune in next time for the adventures of the Crack House Gang. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. If you like what you've seen, hit that subscribe button or leave me a comment on anything you want to see in the future.